everyone, I'm Mol and this time we're gonna play Toy Defense 2. Not so long ago I've made huge progress in this game and I want to boast a little bit. I want to show you how to pass level 56 at Iwo Jima just with your commanders. If you don't know what I'm talking about, please download this game at the link below or just type Toy Defense 2 in Google Play or App Store and we'll play together. So let's go! <laughs> So let's go to our missions and go to level 56, Battle of Iwo Jima. I put two gunmen here, a Soviet one and the British one, and I do it to have the combined defense because Soviet hedgehogs are considered to be the best, but they actually led through bikes and vehicles, so this is why I have the British hedgehog as well. And so these guys will earn us some money and will upgrade our hedgehogs a little bit. And so far it's really, really easy because you see, this is really quick. Let's put some firemen here and firemen are also doing really good and all together they make a really good defense. And you see I always put it on rapid, I just have to make sure that I put my anti-area guns here. They will take care of the planes. I don't put an interceptor so far because it is actually really really powerful and it actually kills all the ground enemies as well. I don't need it so far, maybe now. I guess that I will also need the British artillery. I chose a British artillery because I have a Soviet one as well, but it is really really powerful and I have upgraded it to the splash damage but sometimes it is reloading just for too long this is why I put a British artillery because I also have some basic American artists as well and well so far it is really really quick and I still haven't deployed my Soviet fireman so far. Yep, so far it is nice. And it's wave 14 and things are still the same. All I have to do is to upgrade my commanders. I have noticed that actually upgrading your commanders sometimes is even more important than upgrading your vehicles and your guns. Just because they become super powerful and they can cope with uh, all the enemies themselves as you see here. And I don't have to deploy any more units. So that's what I'm boasting of. Okay, let's put another fireman right here just to fill the gap. Yeah, this is it. And it's wave 20 and still it is very easy. That's it. I will probably use this money to upgrade my army and I will show you some skills of it. So as you see, they all have level 10. What is really important here is actually their profitability, their eagle eye, which means their range and uh, the command and intonation is one of the most important skills to be upgraded their power and their rate of fire make sure that all these skills are actually upgraded however when you reach level 60 or something I will show it to you in my next video you will probably need commanders to be more profitable the price of upgrades should be lower as well so what I will do is to spend my money on my financial skills because sometimes you really have to save money so well and that's it for now thank you so much for playing with me I hope you had fun if you enjoyed the game please download it at the link below and if you enjoyed the video please put your thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and we'll play together see you next time bye bye